be 14 player faces on next gen, so we only have the teams that are uh, Real Madrid and Barcelona, so we're going to show you both teams' faces. So first, in goal for Barcelona, we have Real, we have Victor Valdez, sorry. Uh, at right back for Barcelona, we have Dani Alves, who looks really, really good. They got everything on him, it looks really good. At the center back, we have PK, who looks exactly like himself, and the jerseys and everything look really good. Like they crumple up when you run away and stuff. They look really good. Uh, then we have Javier Mascherano. Uh, this thing keeps messing up. What's wrong with this? We have Javier Mascherano as uh, second center back for Barcelona, who looks really good as well. We have Jordi Alba playing at what I think is left back for Barcelona right now, and he looks stellar as well. At center defensive mid, we have Sergio Busquets, number 16. We have the captain at number 6, Chappie, who looks like he's drunk. We have Iniesta, number 8, who they've given a little bit more hair now, which is good. He just looks like he's folding. Uh, at center forward, we have Messi, whose shorts are really short. But yeah, it looks exactly like him, much better than previous FIFAs, and on next gen, they look even better. And we have Pedro as well, number seven, taking that from David Fio. And we have Neymar, who looks really good as well, with his new hairstyle. So that's Barcelona's team on next gen. Next, we have Diego Alves in goal, which he started in front of Casillas, I guess, because he's getting more playing time in real life. Uh, we have Arabloa as right back for Real Madrid. We have Pepe, number three, he's been doing really well for them. He has an afro now though. We have Sergio Ramos with his new look, captain for them, number four. We have Marcelo, who has his new game face now, looks really good in the game. We have Sammy Kadiris playing CDM right now, looks really good, looks like a true strong soldier in the midfield. We have Xavi Alonso, I don't know what the hell is wrong with his t-shirt, but He's still a really good team player for them. Then you have Gareth Bale, the new world record signing for them, who's looking really good. His new hairstyle and just looks really good with his Tate t-shirt in the game. You have Ronaldo, one of the best players in the game, or one of the second best player in the world, in my opinion. And he's just looking really good. Looks really good like himself. And then we have Benzema, who is their striker, I guess. And then Modric, who I don't know why he's after Benzema. He really shouldn't be playing attack, but he does look really good as well. And the ref, who no one cares about. And then that's how the ball looks. All right, thank you, guys.